Hi, I'm Sophie Uliano at gorgeouslygreen.com and have I got some food for you. So I'm going to show you how to make a incredibly delicious dish, which between you and me is ridiculously easy and it'll knock the socks off your family and friends. So here's what we're going to do. Portobello mushroom burgers. Yum. This actually is a wonderful dish for vegetarians. People who like eating meat, but who are trying to maybe cut down a bit. It's a very meaty dish. It's a sort of hungry man dish. So I'm going to start off with my portobello mushrooms. Get as big ones as you can possibly find. And you're going to peel the mushrooms, just peel the skin off. Now you need a piece of foil, about a square foot of foil, because you're going to be making a little packet. So the first thing I'm going to do is take my mushroom and I am going to brush the underside with a little olive oil, just really to stop it sticking to the foil, like so. And then that is going to go in the center of the package. So unbelievably easy, we're just assembling now a few little things on top of it. So I'm going to take some olive oil, extra virgin, and I'm putting two, two, two tablespoons, excuse me, of olive oil into the center of the mushroom. Now I'm going to take two tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce, like so. Next up is cheese. I like Swiss cheese because it's all stringy and gooey and delicious, or Gruyere is a fantastic cheese to use for this. Just place on top. And then finally, I'm going to take a good handful of freshly chopped flat leaf parsley and sprinkle it all over. Now comes the fun part. Oh, I've got to remember, a little bit of freshly ground black pepper and a pinch of salt. Right, now I'm making my package like this. You don't have to get too exact about this. Just make sure you're basically making a package that's gonna steam the mushroom. And then in it's going to go, in a baking dish, it's going to go into an oven 400 degrees Fahrenheit, and it's going to go in for 20 minutes. Right, so my mushrooms are going to be ready now. I will check, have a little look. Ooh, that looks absolutely perfect. The mushroom's tender and succulent with all that yummy melted cheese on top. Yes, exactly what I wanted. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to build the bun. So right here I have one whole wheat bun, or you can use a sprouted, I also like using sprouted grain buns. Now the first thing I'm going to do is I'm using a chipotle mayonnaise. Now this really gives your portobello burger a little bit of a spicy kick and it pairs beautifully with a succulent juicy portobello mushroom. So to make this very easy mayo, I just get regular mayonnaise and, um, and I add a little bit of uh, chipotle puree. I simply go and get a can of chipotle peppers in an adobe sauce from any grocery store and I put them in my blender, blend them up and then I put them in a uh, jelly, old jelly jar and that'll keep for months in my refrigerator. I add it to soups and all kinds of things. It's absolutely delicious. So I have two tablespoons of plain regular mayonnaise. I have added quarter of a teaspoon of the chipotle puree and mixed it up and then I'm going to generously spread that. Actually, let's go for it. Let's put it on both buns. And people always say, do you want it on one side of a sandwich? I'm like, are you kidding? Mayo, but I really slather it on here. Like so. Then, next up, this succulent mushroom here, which is so meaty and so filling that it will satisfy just about anybody. I'm going to put on a big thick slab of beautiful organic tomato. Then I'm going to take some crunchy romaine lettuce and just put that in there. And just for good measure, a few pickles on top. And then of course, if you want to put on a little tomato ketchup or something, that will work as well. And then I'm going to scrunch it all down and there you have it. An absolutely delicious portobello burger, perfect for the summer. You can also put these little packets on the grill if you fired up the grill outside, just as easy. So for many more fantastic recipes, projects, tips and tricks, I'm your go-to girl. Come to gorgeouslygreen.com.